Oh! Alright, Cowboys of Moo Mesa. Uh, I didn't watch this cartoon, so you guys in the chat are going to have to tell me more about it. But basically, from what I understand, it's just a cowboy western cartoon. It was on, I think, in the early 90s. I think someone that worked on Ninja Turtles had something to do with this. It's very similar to Sunset Riders. It's made by Konami. I think basically they were like, let's take Sunset Riders and turn it into Cowboys of Moo Mesa because we need a Cowboys of Moo Mesa game. This is Sunset Riders with cows. Pretty much, Jerome. Pretty much. Konami. Buffalo Bowl, Montana, Colorado, and Dakota. Let's see. I guess I'm going to be Dakota. Alien vs. Predator. I did Alien vs. Predator. I've already done it. But I would I would do it again, I guess. That one I liked. Check out the recently released Capcom Game Up Collection. Mystic Warriors. Alright. It's, it's so Sunset Riders, not even funny. Do 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 do. Why I have the Castlevania music in my head right now, I don't know. Do 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 do. -do. Law cow. The law. The law. <laughs> the law. The law! <laughs> Boom. You play Pac-Man through Pac-Man Museum Compilation. Oh, okay. Thanks, Intimidation. Um, yes. I, I vaguely remember that. That was a long time ago. But yeah, I did do that. If you guys want to see any of my past arcade live streams and what I've done, um, you can check those out on Cinemassacre Plays. It's actually been quite a while since I've done it. But, um... And I'm willing to re replay any of the ones that I've done already, but um, but I'd like to play other ones that I haven't gotten to. I did Bucky O'Hare Arcade. I've done. I'm trying to think of the name. Rock and I think Rock and Rope. I've done. Um, a lot of stuff. Look look how cartoony this is. This is good graphics. I like this. Mike, do more funny voices. I don't know. As Bruce Campbell would say, what am I, your monkey? I did that as David Letterman. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. Aliens was the one you did. Yeah, I did Aliens. Oh, 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 I see what you're saying. I did Aliens, but I didn't do Alien vs. Predator. Right? Is that... Is that true? I think I think you I think you might be right. Well, wait a second. Didn't we do Aliens vs Predator on? Uh, you know what I'm thinking of? Didn't we do that on James and Mike Monday? Oh, he turns into a fucking steak. Okay, that's funny. Hey, look, an energy an energy bar for a boss. Also good. I like these graphics. They're pretty good. I think they're representative of the series, which I've seen. A little bit of. I watched a little bit of the first episode, and I seen like the intro and stuff. So I, it's not that I haven't seen it at all, but very little. Do the Seinfeld voice. What's the deal with the Cowboys of Moo Mesa? Uh, we're going to a ghost town, partner. Then we're gonna go home for supper. You did Alien vs Predator on a Monday video. Okay. All right, so next one, saddle sore. But up, up, but up, up. You love the maps in these old games. But uh, this is kind of like Superman. It has like a side-scrolling, flying thing. You can shoot in all directions. Eight direction. And apparently you can collect eggs. Oh my god, is this gonna turn into like fucking R-type where you get like a extra extra shot? What is that fucking thing? I 
I don't even know what these things are that are coming towards me. I guess they're, oh, they're like missiles with like bear traps on them. That's weird. Help, help! Shooter, it's like Hogan's Alley. Oh, money? Is it fucking money maker? I want that, I want one of those. Who's the friendly little bee buzzing oh so happily? Buzzing here and buzzing there, busy buzzing everywhere. Buzz off. Every arcade game known to man will be named in the span of 15 minutes. Did Cowboys of Moo Mesa have any toys? I remember, I remember the Darkwing Duck toys I liked a lot. Ba -da 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 -da. I did a video, uh, by the way, about my He-Man collection, if you guys haven't seen it. Um, that is on SEO Toy Review on YouTube, if you guys want to see that. Did I not put the fucking... Oh, there it is. It's a different button for this. Gotta get the money. reminds me of the Simpsons a little bit too with like the balloon. Isn't there a balloon kind of boss in the Simpsons arcade game? I think there might be. Smithers or some shit? I forget it. Ooh. See if I do this, I can kind of ooh, get shots in continually. Except it's a little more risky with these things shooting out. I think that mouth should open to shoot those things out. Well, I guess that wouldn't make sense if it's a fucking balloon. Never mind. Take that back. Take it back. Strike that. Reverse it. Boom. Go down, motherfucker. You're gone. You are gone. These guys would make great action figures. Oh, fuck. I guess I'm not. Oh my god, look at this, look at this, look at this. Oh shit. Moo! Clawful. Yeah, sorry, I don't I don't know more about Cowboys and Moon Mesa to, to give you any, any real commentary about it. It's not one that I watched. Have any of you guys in the chat watched all of the episodes of Cowboys and Moon Mesa? It didn't have a ton of episodes, right? Isn't it one of those ones that had like 13 episodes or something? I think it might be. Ooh, you can do the roll. Damn it. Even though I'm using a lot of quarters, not really, but um, I just like to be able to see all these games. You know? I keep forgetting what button it is to do that. Ooh, I've got a different gun here. I would imagine, I guess that's stronger, right? Oh, fucker. Seems like a different gun, at least. I'm shooting sheriff badges here. 
Okay, he's going fucking crazy now. He's a wild man. Come on. Oh, look how fucking close this guy is. Give me a break. Give me a break, I sure deserve it. It's time I made it to the top. Give me a break, I sure deserve it. 26 episodes over two seasons. Oh, okay, more than I thought. Simpsons Arcade Balloon. It's crusty fight. Biker Mice from Mars. All right. Jane Meadow, she's she's a she's a butt. <laughs> she's a butt. The Popeye arcade game, yep, yep, yep. How many quarters would I have wasted so far? I remember wasting a lot of quarters playing the actual Double Dragon arcade. Beat that game in Disney World. When I was a kid, I did, I did. We had an arcade. You know what the coolest fucking thing is there that they still have? Um, the like shooting gallery with the actual like guns that you could shoot. I mean, not real guns, but like the light guns. Fuck. Back when arcades were decent. Did you have the Toxic Avenger or Bucky O'Hare toys? Uh, no, I did not. Um, however, I did have the Bucky O'Hare NES game, which is really weird that I have not streamed that yet. I will, I will do that someday. Um, I have beaten that game more than once, so I don't know why I have not streamed that yet. I actually own that game in the box. Oh my god, look at this. So. Yeah, I will definitely stream Bucky O'Hare. Bucky, Captain Bucky O'Hare, mutants and aliens and toad, beware. Are you guys seeing like when the characters half disappear on the screen? It's really weird. I guess, you know what, I'm looking at the capture thing and it doesn't look like that, so I don't know. It looks like it for me. Like right there, they have, like he's half dis disappearing. Okay, I really got a tap hard there. Fucking cock. Yeah, what's up cock? What's up, vagina fuck fuck? Yeah. I'm so stupid. Fuck you, fuck you, dick, dick, dick. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> I remember when we shot that, James thought that was so fucking funny. I, I thought it was so fucking stupid. And he's like, oh, we're, inc we're including that, Mike. <laughs> Jesus Christ. When, that's, when you, that's what James calls an intake. It's just like you do you do a lot of improv stuff, but that you don't intend to keep, but then you keep it. There, there's a um, look at this fucking boss, by the way. That's pretty cool. Um, there is a moment in the nerd Indiana Jones episode where James, I think it's at the end. James whips the game. Or something, but then he accidentally hit hit the light. But he thought that that was more funny, I think, than the actual ending. So he kept it. He kept it in. <laughs> but um, that's a nerd. That's a nerd episode that I did not help out on at all. Other than other than I did the, the title card. But yeah, um, I didn't help play the game or anything. That was that was all James for that episode. And that, that's a really good nerd video. He's actually he James actually knows how to like really play that Atari game really well. And speaking of Indiana Jones, I want to stream the Temple of Doom um, arcade game. Here we go again on our own.
Remember the Ace Ventura cartoon? Oh my god, the Ace Ventura cartoon. I fucking forgot that existed. That fucking, yeah. I, I vaguely fucking remember something like that. Alrighty then. I'm so sorry for that. <laughs> like a glove. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Uh, I used to watch him on In Living Color. He was pretty funny. The Mask cartoon. Was there a ma Mask cartoon? I actually I saw that movie in the theater too. I mean, Jim Carrey hasn't made anything in a long time, huh? Mike Myers too. And I know the whole thing. He like pissed a bunch of people off or whatever. I think it's been long enough. He should fucking bring back. Um, you know what? I was just gonna say he should bring back. Austin Powers, but he did because he he did uh, Doctor Evil on Saturday. Uh, I guess it was Saturday Night Live. It was Saturday Night Live, or maybe it was. It must have been Saturday Night Live, or maybe it was like the fucking Oscars or something. Was that fucking wild when fucking Captain Kirk came back with fucking Seth MacFarlane on the fucking Oscars? I was like, holy fucking shit, when that happened. I hope, I hope something like that happens again. I, I fucking love that. I don't even care. Because to get any, like, fucking Shatner as fucking Kirk, that makes me extremely happy. Even if it's a joke. Like, why is this not starting? Oh my god, is this the last guy? Oh my, oh, okay. Woo, I don't know what was happening right there, but I almost fucking fucked that up. The game, like, the game was not starting. I guess it's X, not A. Whew, I almost totally fucked that up. Jim Carrey didn't act in it. He didn't act in what? I, re I really like the Man on the Moon movie. If you have not seen the behind the scenes thing on that, there's a behind the scenes movie thing on, uh, oh, of course that's not the last guy. There's all this shit left. Um, I can't remember what it's called, but there's, there's, a, there's like a documentary thing about how that was made. He did, he does such a good, and Jim and Andy, that's the name of it. Um, he does such a fucking good job. Like, um, it's actually better than the movie. Watch fucking, if you're any kind of fan of like Andy Kaufman, watch, um, watch that movie. And you know what? A lot of times I don't like, um, you know, I guess, I don't, I don't know. A lot of times I don't like when somebody plays like a character, but he did such a fucking good job at that, I thought, and I'm a huge Andy Kaufman fan, like he was really perfect, but in a lot of the behind the scenes thing, you don't even like, I didn't really respect how good he did, if you, if you see that, like he is like exactly like Andy Kaufman, it's actually really amazing, um, and if you've never seen any Andy Kaufman stuff, Fucking check out, check out Andy Kaufman on David Letterman. He was, um, that's might be like my favorite David Letterman, um, guest. Um, I also think the Paris Hilton thing's really fucking funny too, by the way. But, um, uh, fucking, can you blow these things up? Oh, you know what? I probably had to roll through them. Um, yeah, Andy Kaufman on fucking Letterman is really fucking funny. There's one where he dresses up um, with like a turban and he's playing like, like uh, is it like a Conway T Twitty song or some shit? But um, he's really funny. And then there's another one where he comes on and he, the, this is the fucking funniest thing. He comes on like he's like, he's like out of work or whatever. Or he, and he's, it's like, it's fucking really funny. It's like er really early Letterman when he had the morning show. But that is fucking funny as shit. He like totally fucks with the audience, and then he goes into the he li he literally goes into the audience, and he's like holding out he's holding out his hand, like asking the audience for money. It's so fucking funny. Oh my god, I fucking love Andy Kaufman. <laughs> All right, another balloon boss, really. <laughs> I got you know what? That's more of a vulture. It's like vulture, vulture man. I love Thundercats so much. I'm sorry. 
real Thundercats and not that fucking travesty. Did that show ever come on, by the way? Does that show? I, I almost want to watch. I mean, I don't. I do not want to watch it, but I almost want to watch it just to see how fucking god awful it is. Kind of like the. You know, I'm not gonna watch it, by the way. <laughs> but um, fucking, I never saw that Ghostbusters movie, and the thing, I had no fucking interest in, in seeing that, and it has nothing to do with, you know, fucking um, whatever. <laughs> I don't even want to fucking talk about that movie. It's just bad. Like bad script, bad trailer. Just bad. I like fucking. I like just the first Ghostbusters movie. It's, that movie's a fucking masterpiece. Oh, and I just did a thing, by the way, with the uh, Spider-Man game, where I found uh, the locations for um, the Ghostbusters firehouse, which is really fun. If you guys got the. Uh, Spider-Man game, which you should get that fucking game. It's so good. I should st start streaming that again. I kind of took a break from it because it was kind of going on a, lot, a while, but I actually want to get back to that too. That game's so good. It's very much like Arkham City, but Arkham City is amazing. So, you know, I'm 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 good. Like if you're gonna copy a great game, like kind of like go ahead. Uh, thanks, Elric, uh, OV, Chaos, for subbing with Twitch Prime. You guys have Amazon Prime. You can sub for free. And that helps us get emotes, and it helps all your Twitch streamers. New Thundercats show has not come out yet, from what you can see. Okay, I hope it doesn't fucking come out at all. Fuck that shit. Fuck that shit. You're better off fucking shit than fucking with that shit. Oh my god. I should have picked somebody else, sorry. Do 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 Bum 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 do 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 At least Ghostbusters 2 had the original cast. Damn right it did. Where am I supposed to hit right here? Not really. Maybe I just have to Oh, is it this cannon? Yes, I can. I was trying to figure out where the hell. Are we? Did oh, did the cannon come back? What the hell? How strong is this goddamn cannon? There it is. Choo choo. By the way, I like Back to the Future three. I like all the Back to the Future movies. Look at this shit. Back to the Future three. I also I saw actually I saw all the Back to the Future movies in the theater. Um. I fucking love those movies. That's one of the best trilogies of all time. Oh my god, you know what I just thought of? I totally forgot. I'm gonna stream the fucking Famicom Back to the Future game. I totally forgot about that. I was planning to do that like a month ago and then I totally fucking forgot. Do 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 I got the Superman music stuck in my head. That's okay though, it's fucking the greatest theme. Boom, motherfucker. Boom, boom, boom. Colorado. Do you have any rare TurboGrafx-16 games? Um, you guys want me to pull out my uh, TurboGrafx-16 games? I'll do that real quick. Let me let me take a quick break, and I will. I will do that. Somebody asked me for my TurboGrafx-16 collection, so we will go through them. We got Super Star Soldier. Boom. Actually, that's the game that I thought the other thing was that I just streamed. Um, oh, fuck. Stardust. Super Stardust. I have Raiden. Not to be confused with the Mortal Kombat character. I want to stream the Raiden games. They are shooters. Bonk's Revenge. I've never streamed a Bonk game, but I played Bonk's Adventure by myself and almost beat it, but I lost. <laughs> that was just me playing on my own. Believe it or not, I do stream arcade game. I do stream games on my... I do play games on my own um, sometimes. Splatterhouse we did for James and Mike Monday. Or, yeah, it was James and Mike Monday. JJ and, and Jeff. I don't know if any of these games are rare, but... Um, I forget. I think I, I think I don't really like that game. Pac Land. 
Here you go, Pac-Man. Great game. There's all kinds of weird things that happen in that game. Um, Pac-Man was like the first, pretty much the first game I ever played, by the way. Um, I think actually the only thing I played before that, I think, was... Pac-Man was the first arcade game I ever played. First game, like, console game I ever played was, um, like, Pac-Man and, um, on Atari. And, um, like, a couple Atari games, like Jungle Hunt and, uh, what's the name of it? Star Voyager, which is not a very good game. But, uh, okay, so I have R-Type Complete CD. R-Type games are fucking hard. Oh, and then I have a regular R-Type. Um, all good stuff. <laughs> this is when, this is, pr uh, this one's pr uh, prior to Bonk, when Bonk, Bonk became the mascot. This is Keith Courage. I think this is, like, the most, um... Uh, easiest to find Turbo Graphics game. Like, I don't, I don't think that one's not too hard to get. Let's see what you guys are saying real quick. Class Show and Dell. He drinks too much water and coffee. I don't drink enough water, and I drink too much coffee. You have Cosmic Fantasy 2 before. By the way, any of these games, I don't know how rare these games are, so you guys can let me know which one of these is the rarest, because I have no idea. Oh, here's Bonk's Adventure. Um, this is one that I made it to the last guy on, on my own. Didn't beat it, though. I have Bomberman 93. Love the Bomberman stuff. I should stream more Bomberman. I did Bomberman. I did Saturn Bomberman, which is, like, the best Bomberman game. And I also did Bomberman on NES, which is not as good. Doesn't TurboGrafx-16 have cartridge add-on? Well, it's got the Hue card. You put the Hue cards in, and then there's, like, the CD attachment. I don't know what you mean by cartridge. Magical Chase is still obscenely expensive. I do not have Magical Chase. Bomberman 93 goes for 150 Oh, shit. I didn't, I didn't pay that much for it. Um, there you go. That is the, have I, you know what, I didn't, I haven't done this yet. But this is very similar to the NES game. I keep forgetting to do that. Uh, Vigilante. Mm, I don't know, I don't remember anything about that. Legendary Axe. I paid $20 apparently for that one. Which is, that's overpriced for that, isn't it? Um, Final Zone 2. Actually, I have not played that. Ninja Spirit. I think I played this one before. I only got a couple more. Got that one. I think that's... I think that's a good game, huh? Kadash. Kadash, Kadash. I remember on a stream one time, somebody asked me if I had that. And I do. There it is. Oh, here, this is a really good game. I should stream this. I, I need to stream that. And here, this is the last one. This is the one that was in the nerd video. This was the game that was used in the nerd video. And because you guys are probably very interested in this one, I will show you. Here's the Hue card. By the way, is it Hue card or Who card? Just say first or second pronunciation so I know. Hue. Yeah. Um, Darkwing Duck. I'm showing the manual stuff. Hue card. Like, okay, it's Hue card, not Who card. Okay, it's Hue. I was never sure. Darkwing Duck. I used to watch some of Darkwing Duck. I like DuckTales better. Because DuckTales was a better show. Sorry. Um, read the comics. <laughs> I actually, you know what? I actually just got the latest um, Carl Barks collection. Um, one, the newest one just came out, and it has Titanic Ants in it, which is, the, they made a DuckTales episode off of that, so you guys should really get those if I can recommend anything to you. 
get the Karl Barth comics. All right, let's see. It's like the only thing I like better than <laughs> whatever. Uh, I'm getting back to the game here. So, do -do 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 -do. Wild West Cowboys of Moon Mesa. I just fucked this up. Hang on a second, because I'm still on screen. There it is. Okay. All right, back to the game. Darkwing Duck goes for $200? I didn't know that. Jesus Christ. All right. I think I got it for like 30 bucks. That's crazy. Would you consider doing a TurboGrafx-16 marathon? Uh, marathon stuff's hard. Like, I could do maybe like a couple games, but if you mean like do all the games, like, it, t it takes too long to... Um, like, I might do a couple. Like, what I'm doing here, I might do a couple games, but... A marathon? I don't, I don't know. But keep watching my streams, and I will definitely stream a lot of TurboGrafx-16 stuff, because I, lo I love TurboGrafx-16. I really love PC Engine, because, you know, it's a lot of shooters, and I love shooters. Not shmups. I like to call it shooters. Because I'm a dork. What job did you have before this stuff? Uh... My previous job, I worked with James, actually, doing video editing. Believe it or not. Actually, technically, the job I had, never mind, the job I had previous to this was editing the videos for Spike with James. So, yeah, I, ed I edited all the, um, the Spike reviews for, for Cinemat. Do you guys remember that when we were on Spike? That was my previous job, technically. Which was basically like working for Cinemassacre, but it was Spike, so. And before that, James and I had an editing job t together. And that was back in 2005. So James made the Simon's Quest video and handed that to me on a VHS tape. Um, actually not the Cinemassacre Gold Collection, but just like a VHS tape. Um, and then, what is this bomb above my head? Like, how is that used? I don't get what that is. How do I? Oh! If you hit both buttons, you can use that. Okay, I just figured that out. Um... Wait, you and James was on Spike TV? No, well, we were on their website. Um, I forget what year that was. Um, that must have been like 2007 or 8. That's when, uh, that's when James was doing the game trailers and stuff. Um, yeah, but we worked for Spike. Spike TV is no more. Do they always work in videos? Pretty much. I mean, except for like before college. What system is this on? This is an arcade game. And I have played the arcade of this once. They're, they had it at a convention. Actually, I think this game was at SGC a long time ago. I think that's where I played this game. Pretty sure. I don't think they had this game at Fun Spot. By the way, if you guys have not been to fucking Fun Spot, go like right now. <laughs> It's fucking amazing. Go there and fucking support Fun Spot because it's the best, pretty much the best art. And I know people are gonna mention Galloping Ghost, but Fun Spot is like, 
is like the best fucking arcade in the world, pretty much. And I've been, I've been to uh, a bunch of the ones that are still around now. I've been, I've been to a bunch of barcades and stuff. And barcades are cool, but Fun Spot is the fucking legit shit. I really like this horror stage, by the way. This, I always love horror stages. And no, I'm not saying horror. It's like a horror taking a shit. What's the line in AVGM? I think that's the line. What episode is that? I can't remember. Colorado? Have I been to the barcades in New York City? Um, I actually, I don't think I've been to any in New York City. Uh, actually, no, that's not true. I, w I was at one. Um, Is there one in like, is there one in Queens? I forget, I don't remember where that was. Fuck. Uh, this guy's pretty cool. Reminds me of the guy on Splash Mountain. At the end of Splash Mountain with the, uh, the like Raven dudes. Wait a second. Yeah, that's Splash Mountain. Dead and Dead? No, because he's a... Well, actually, what am I talking about? He's got the fucking life meter on the bottom. He's not dead at all. Think you can block my shots? You can't block shit, Birdman. It's reminding me of the Grave Digger in... Fucking Ocarina of Time. Fucking speaking of Ocarina of Time, I need to stream that. There's so much shit I gotta fucking stream. I'll, ne I'll never keep up. There's so many video games. Too many games, too many games, too many games! That's what Justin says, that at too many games. I always think that's so funny. Um, too many games was actually called something else prior to that. I can't remember off the top of my head what it was called. But that was actually the first convention I ever went to. First gaming convention I ever went to, anyway. Um, first convention I ever went to was a Star Trek convention in 1995. And that is where I saw a Klingon stab another Klingon. Move the cursor to the stage you want to go to. Partner, it's almost time for supper. Do 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 I'm pausing for one second. The horse shit joke is from Dick Tracy. Is that what it's from, Cletus? Well, Mary Jo Joe's gonna go fuck some chickens. Who's the dude in my chat that said fucking chicken fuckers? <laughs> Some of you guys are gonna have no idea what I'm talking about. We're gonna go do the pigs. Boxing glove. Now I'm reminded of Bugs Bunny's uh, crazy castle. You know what I'm dying to play? Um, fucking the Pokemon Eevee fucking thing. Because I'm like, I'm, I gotta tell you guys, <laughs> this is so sad because I know, I know a lot of you guys hate it, but I've been playing a lot of Pokemon Go. You know what the thing is that's good about, about Pokemon Go is it gets me out of the house, and which is super important for me because all I fucking do is stream, right? <laughs> huh, there's some other things I do, but... <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, chicken fucker. Oh, look at the... It's like the thing from Berserk. Actually, that has a frowny face, doesn't it? I reckon. Pokemon Go in 2018. I know. But people are... Believe it or not, people are still very into Pokemon Go. Do, 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 do. Yuck, 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 yuck. I'm on Pokemon Go every day, 18k, but it only says about, it says I do about 
10 the fucker. 18, what are you talking about? I don't know what you're talking about. It's like Rolling Rock. We're gonna go fuck the cows out yonder. Actually, I noticed that James hasn't been doing the Rolling Rock lately, has he? We gotta bring that back. I don't want to tell him. Where's the fucking Rolling Rock? Oh my god! This is fucking, just looks like the um, Sunset Riders thing when you jump, except they're on the sides, you know? In the middle of fucking Sunset Riders. And, and I know this game is like, Konami and whatever, but. Ooh, look at those cards. It's like the Mickey Mouse through the mirror cartoon now. Da -da 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 -da. Start the game, motherfucker. By the way, um, you know that, I don't know if you guys have seen the Through the Mirror Mickey Mouse cartoon, but the sequence that, where Mickey Mouse has the, um, the top hat and the cane in that, which is awesome, uh, animation, but that was animated by Carl Barks when he was still in the Disney animation department. Please start this. And this is so weird how this works. I'm so scared that I'm gonna fuck this up. Oh my god. The Joker! Did you ever dance with the devil in the pale moonlight? I always ask that of all my prey. So good. Fucking great movie. Jack Nicholson, man. One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest. Fucking awesome movie. The Shining, obviously. Um, and Batman. Thank you, Green Lantern, for subbing with Twitch Prime. Three months of fun as a sub. It's September, partner. Head for the hills, boy. Oh my God. Do 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 do. Jack Nicholson emote. We definitely do. The mask bull. One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest is excellent. It's another one of my favorites. Love that movie. I love the music that they play, that Nurse Ratchet puts on. Or whatever one of the trip fucking nurses puts on, on the fucking record player. So fucking good. There you go, you gotta roll through these barrels. Do-da, do-da. I just feel like doing that kind of shit in the stream with all the western cowboys and shit. Hey Mike, Ghostbusters 2009 October stream? That's a really fucking good idea. I'm gonna write that down right now. Who said that? The Ledigan David. Thank you so much. How you doing? Uh, I have not seen you in here before, but that's a great idea. And I already did the NES game several times, so I'm done with that. Good fucking idea. Thank you. I almost forgot about that, that I have not streamed that. Good fucking idea. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Don't forget Cesar Romero. Cesar Romero is what I based the Joker on um, and when I did AVGN. Some people were like, this isn't sound like Heath Ledger. Well, it's fucking Cesar Romero, because I'm a huge fan of um, the Batman 60s series. First show I ever really watched. So. And, and by the way, it was an exaggerated impression, just the way my impressions are. Um, like, my impression of uh, the lion from The Wizard of Oz. I like to do exaggerated exaggerated impressions. Also, like my impression, if you haven't noticed, of Bugs Bunny. <coughs> What's up, Doc? What's cooking? What's up, Doc? Are you looking for Bugs Bunny bunting? Duck is gonna hunt him just to get a rabbit skin, but now we're coming back again. What's up, Doc? I really mean it. What's cooking, Doc? Stallone impressionist top. There you go, that's another exaggerated impression. I guess that's just what I do. Hey, 
and tell me that my house is a piece of fucking junk, you know? So he can get the hell out of my apartment, you know? He comes over here and says, like, your apartment's a piece of shit. I'm like, I can't afford a good apartment. This ain't Rocky Four, you know? I don't got no money. Rocky Three, I mean, because I was fucking poor. No, I, I was I was rich, actually, in Rocky Three and Four. It was five I was poor in, you know? Hey, God, this ain't no pie contest. But Mickey come over there, and I'm like, yeah, my apartment stinks. That's right, it stinks! And you think Bullet to the Head stinks too? Well, screw you, because Bullet in the Head was great. It stinks! Oh, God. Look at Stallone and think, oh, fuck, oh, fuck, oh, fuck. I'm gonna, I swear to God, I'm gonna fuck this up. Oh my god, it's fucking cactus. Fucking Jesus Christ. Hold up. You can kill these things, right? Sounds like younger Rocky II Stallone. It might be. I don't know. I don't know what the fucking impression is. That's, that's, that's stupid. <laughs> cactus cocks. <laughs> Spiked cactus cocks. <laughs> That's what you get fucked in the ass by, by a western demon. If you were in hell, getting fucked up the ass for a million years by a fucking demon. With a cactus cock. <laughs> yeah, cactus cock, cock. It's like having a unicorn. Uh, what's the unicorn line? Fuck, I can't remember. I don't remember. It's funny if cactuses were like shit pickle. Shit. Hey, yo, Polly. Get that turkey out of the oven, yo. I'd rather see Sylvester the cat. What, then Sylvester Stallone? I fucking, I love the Sylvester cartoons. I love all that shit. All the Golden Age animation. Gak. Devil cows. Oh, these are the fucking devils that will, will fuck you up the ass for a million years in hell. By the way, there they are. They made their appearance. And, and then they will burn you to, to death. Because that's what happens in hell. It's like, this guy's like fucking Ganon or some shit. No, he's the fucking dude at the end of Castlevania. I love, by the way, at the fucking end of uh, Rondo of Blood, how it was just like the first Castlevania. How it was... And we turn him into snake steak. Um, it's a fillet now, bitch. Sirloin for supper. Um, it turned into the blue beast. Shot. Shoot, shoot it. It really has to say shot as if you wouldn't know to shoot it. Cookie monster? What are we talking about? Fucking cookie monster now? Oh, because he's blue. Yep. Yes, he is. Or uh, fucking Grover and shit. Quick, do the Konami code. And I can't roll through it. This is a pretty fun game. This is, this is not a bad, like, si like beat the beat em up, whatever, side scrolling thing. I kind of like it. Some people call the second form of Dracula Cookie Monster in Castlevania 1. Oh, yeah, that's true. I've heard that before. I forgot. Oh, is this the last dude? This is like the last dude, isn't it? It might be. Colorado! Oh boy, oh boy. Thank you, Marshal Moo! It appears the masked bull has made his escape to the skull, something or other, I missed it. Uncle, Scro <laughs> Uncle Scrooge's money in the background. Uncle Scrooge has a lot more money than that. Come on. That ain't shit. Uh-oh. 
got the coming up and down thing like the fucking Rose dude. And... Oh shit. Sunset Riders. Shit, pickle. Oh my god. Let's rodeo! Mary, Mary Lou, Betsy, my Parker. Let's rodeo. Is that supposed to be like? Um, there's there's a Ninja Turtle line that I'm trying to think of. Um, fuck. They say something like that. I'm trying to think of what it is. God damn it! This is rough. I can't imagine you fucking doing this in the arcade. Spend a fucking hundred dollars. Jesus Christ. <sighs> oh my god, he's M. Bison now. You fucking kidding me? Motherfucker! Cow bitch. Oh my god, and look at his health. Oh my god, I'm not fucking gonna beat this. I mean, <laughs> I'm so scared of fucking up the fucking quarter thing. A Raiden? I guess, wait, was I thinking of Raiden? Does M. Bison do that too? Shit, I might be thinking of Raiden. Never mind. Jesus Christ. Hundred dollars and quarters. Buffalo Bill! Play Commando. Oh shit. Bison does it, but he spins. Oh yeah. I think is this guy spinning too? Let's see if he does it again. Well I got him halfway down at least. Quarter muncher motherfucker. Oh, stay close to him. Here we go, now I'm actually getting in hits, I think. Yeah, I am. Uh, did he spin? I think he spun. Yeah, he's spinning. He's totally M. Bison. Capcom's gonna sue. <laughs> now, in 2018. Yeah, totally duck with this guy, by the way. Boom! His horns spin. It's cross code? I don't know that one. Ba da dum, ba da dum. So, uh, that is, I believe that's the end of the game, yep. I like this game. Um, by the way, I also like Ninja Baseball Batman. Those are... and Bucky O'Hare. These games are all worth playing. But somebody asked earlier if I did, we did Alien vs Predator. If you want to see that, probably check out the James and Mike Monday episode. But I have some good ideas from the chat. So Gunsmoke, Spider-Man, Gun Dot Smoke, Spider-Man, Captain America and the Avengers. Battletoads Arcade, and so many things to stream. Double Dragon, once again. 